What's going on you guys? It's George and welcome back to my channel. And today we are talking about boots. It can be the staple of any outfit. It can seal a deal and make an outfit. There are so many variations of boots, like a work boot, rain boot, snow boot, any weather boot, a dress boot. Every man should own a reliable pair of boots and all of those categories. And today what I'm gonna do is share with you guys my personal favorite pairs of boots that I own. So if you're a boot lover like me, or you're new to the boot community, then keep watching this video. The first type of boot that I wanna talk about today are working boots. And working boots are simply just your everyday type of boot. Like your weatherproof boots, your ones that you would wear to the grocery store, ones you could wear almost, almost anywhere. And these are my favorite pairs of those type of boots. I honestly own too many shoes that I didn't even want to count them. And if I did, I wouldn't tell you the number because it's um, probably an embarrassing amount. Timberland is a great, reliable pair of boots. I've never had a bad experience with Timberland other than the suede. Um, but this is my favorite pair that I own. They are a camo hunter green color boots. And they have like a camo under right here. These are fun wear. I don't wear them too often. That's why they're kind of in like decent condition, but these are probably my favorite pair of Timberland boots. I own several other pairs of Timberlands, including the camel Tims, but these get beat up so fast that like hunter boots are also great. I got myself a pair of hunter. I think these are classified as like any weather type of boot, but they're short. I'm not really too sure of the style, what you would call this, but if I find out, I'll put it in, in the description below. Um, but they have the symbolic Hunter on the back. Is it just me or is Hunter's packaging pretty grand? I kind of love that. The last working type of boot that I want to talk about would be from L.L. Bean. And this company is simply just like an outdoor company. They have a lot of outdoor gear and they are known for their duck boots. These became a pretty big hit within the past like year and a half, um, kind of on the hipster side, but I had these when I was a kid. They're really comfortable. I wear um, heavy socks with these and I don't like get too sweaty or anything. And they clean up really well too. These go great with like a flannel or just like a simple outfit. Um, I wear them a lot in the winter, but this fall I just started wearing them quite often too. A lot of companies make like knockoff versions of these, but this is the OG and you can definitely tell the the difference um quality wise because I, I tried on a pair of target before and they are not the same no. the next type of boots that i'm going to talk about is probably not going to be a surprise to you considering i talk about this type of boot in almost every video if you guess it you're right it's chelsea boots these right here are my chelsea boots my personal favorites i have a nude black mocha and kind of like a caramel color and i wear these all the time they go with almost every outfit they kind of like dress up your everyday outfit but at the same time give you like a a rugged look in a way in my opinion and chelsea boots come in many different types you can get them with like a square toe or like a pointy toe overall though i mean you can't go wrong with a great pair of chelsea boots so i mean i definitely recommend guys do yourself a favor check out your nearest shoe store and buy yourself a pair of Chelsea boots. You will thank me later. Everybody has their personal favorite pair of shoes, whether it's like a boot, sneakers, whatever. This old faithful pair of shoes I'm gonna share with you guys, they're dear to my heart. So judge lightly, they're brown, they're big, and they're Ashton Gray. And I'm not ashamed nor embarrassed of the condition of these things. Yes, they are worn, but they have been around for ages and they have done me well for a very long time. When I say these have been around, like they've probably been around years and uh, no, they're not in the greatest condition, but throw these on a nice pair of skinny jeans, a flannel, a sweater, whatever, and it works. They give you like a rugged, but edgy look and they're age appropriate for me. So I love these, they're my favorite pair of shoes. These are so worn that the shoelaces are even like falling apart. I know I can get that replaced, but it gives a character. All right, you guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to share with you my favorite pairs of boots 
And if you're a guy that's out there looking for um, like a style change or interested in like upping your boot game, then I hope you enjoyed this video. And I also want to give this right here, this prick, a uh, shout out because this whole summer I've been eyeing this up and I finally caved and bought this cactus. Now that like winter is coming, um, I just thought why not give it a home. So it's not, it's healing in the little parts like right here, but I have a feeling she's going to turn around. I never realized how expensive cactuses are until I bought this and um, I don't regret it, but I just hope I can keep it alive. But regardless, I mean, I've been eyeing it up for such a while and finally um, I visited the greenhouse and it was there and I was, you know, convinced. It just, I couldn't go home without it. This cactus is like four feet tall. It's, it's huge. I love the thought of having like greens in the house, but I'm just not the best person when it comes to plants. For some reason, I, I just can't keep them alive. Um, I've even killed cactuses before. Like, how does that even happen? And um, succulents are, I guess, the thing for people that um, need low maintenance. So I was told to really water this every couple months. Um, I hope that's right, because I don't plan on watering it anytime soon. So let me know if that's not okay. But that's pretty much it for this video, guys. I know it was short, but I just want to do kind of like a fast fashion video for boots and uh, talk about this pretty. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and of course, subscribe to my channel. That is much appreciated, like always. And until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.